you guys you guys see that? We're gonna be on that plane, that exact one right there. That's our gate. We're leaving here. We're at LAX. Kind of a gloomy day. Where are we going, Chan the Man? Stockholm. We're going to Sweden. Oh. I don't speak Swedish, but I look Swedish. Oh, I have a really bad hair day today. We're leaving. We're going on a trip in our favorite yeah, rocket ship. Through. Flying through. We're we'll seeing if we're going to fly the drone in here. I doubt they will. They have to be five miles from an airport. We are in the heart of the airport. Let's go to Sweden. My goal is to get Soldier Nation playing on that screen right there. That is a 40, look, those are people down there. It's like a 60 foot LCD screen. Can you guys hear the music playing on that right now? Just how does it go? That is awesome. Yes. That is awesome. I want to be a mall security guard that goes around on a Segway. Because I think that would be pretty amazing. So this is the this is the international terminal. We have Gucci, Burberry, Herpes. Oh, I mean Hermes, Herman, I don't know how you say that. <laughs> I'm a Herman. <laughs> I'm a Herman. Fred Siegel, I once bought a sweatshirt there. $160, I didn't look at the price tag. I'm sorry, mom, don't kill me. Um, we're gonna go see if they'll let Chandler into the lounge this time. Guys, I don't pay for Chandler's flights. It's in my contract at Optimum Books them, but, and let's not kid around. Um, there aren't a whole lot of Optimum athletes that fly business class, so don't feel too bad for Chan the man. I was just late in my career that I started flying business class. I don't need to all of your guys' comments. Poor Chandler. He's going to Sweden. Here's what we're working on. We've got a juice bar. So I am just going to put a juice a little bit. Just a little bit. I don't know where you guys are going to take that. No, or just a little bit of juice. A little, a little carrot, a little celery, a little uh, kale. See how this goes. The spill. We'll throw a little bit of. I'll try that. Cheers. This little beef curry dish and a salad and my juice. Please check in at the desk at gate number 150. Now, this is cool. Pinkberry, Pinkberry in the airport. Do you guys have the, the dairy, do you guys have the dairy free coconut? No, unfortunately not right now. Our pets' heads are falling <laughs> off. What, what, do you guys have any dairy free? No, dairy no, free, right just an all fruit smoothie. An all fruit smoothie? Yeah, the all fruit smoothie features like a pear and peach juice and then we just add two Side of your I you've already okay. you've I already know. been I here. Okay. I I I love the coconut. I have one literally like five seconds from my house, like five feet, and I eat there every day. You guys know that. How are you guys doing today? Though? Doing good. All right. All right. New friends in the airport. Follow me on Snapchat. Steve Cook Hell. Shameless plug. Bye guys. This is gonna be home sweet home for the next ten hours or so. Not bad enough to have Wi-Fi. I want to watch Game of Thrones. We'll go, seat will go all the way down. What do we got here? <laughs> all right. I'm gonna be doing some calf raises on this the entire way. Gotta get my calf game up. Um, shoes definitely gotta come off. We're gonna go in a little cubby here. Bed's gonna go all the way down. So this seat will recline all the way. Got the controls right here. We're just gonna go ahead and I guess we can't do that until we take it off. Sorry. Um, going through little bows, a little water. I'm, I'm one upping their water here though. On a flight, you can't drink enough water. I know it's silly, but like every time I, I can fly business class, it's like opening up a present. I'm trying to do it one handed. Let's see what we got in here. Can you ask your favorite? Yeah. Can you help me to put Oh, you bet. I can definitely help you to put, put up your bag. Be right back. Gonna go help her put up her bag. Right here? Yeah. 
I'm back. One. What is that? A eye mask so you can sleep? Earphones. Or earplugs. Eye mask, earplugs, socks. The most comfortable socks in the world. I like the blue theme we're going with too. I'm gonna stitch together right here. Okay, we also have whatever this is. Refreshing travel kit. Sixth Avenue, below 9th Street. I'm thinking that's New York. Um, Cole Hahn. I also have headphone covers. Do, you want, do I need to use these? Like, are my headphones not sterile enough? Um, toothbrush. Toothbrush, floss, and kit. Let's see this here. I'm gonna open this up. We have, what is this here? Body lotion, just in case I want to rub all over my body. Lip balm. Lip balm. Boom. Awesome lip balm. Get super chapped lips when you buy. I like it, guys. Definitely gonna put those socks on because if I don't, my socks get too tight and it leaves uh, it leaves a mark around my my ankles when I fly. Look who it is! What is that? Where's mine? Um, stewardess. I'm like a Reese's. Take it from this man right here. I don't know him. He's not my father. Really, Chandler, a guy. I don't know. Actually, I probably most people, but he eats. Buttercups, like gloves in and out. Just, ah, he must be bulky. He must be bulky. He's on that big program, so um, probably gonna afford the calories. Ooh. Champagne and orange juice just went by. I'll have neither. All the champagne and water, hold the champagne. Let's figure out what we're gonna eat. The starter tonight is the portobello mushroom carpaccio. That sounds good. Salad, uh, the spinach, the strawberry, blue cheese. I'm gonna do that minus the blue cheese. Hi. Hi there. Oh, how are you? <laughs> I like your glasses. Thank you. We're gonna be twinning here in a minute. Thank okay, you. Michelle, we're gonna be friends. All right, I'll do the, the hell of it for the hell of it. Seafood, you got it, all right. Perfect. Perfect. Thanks so much. Thank you. Hi. Making new friends on the plane. Making new friends on the plane. Got the hell of it, guys. Because I guarantee you, ooh, dessert. Ben and Jerry's cookie and cream ice cream. Or seasoned mousse cake. Gourmet cheese plate. I'm going to have it all. Thank you. I'm going to have that right there. That right there. You guys can't even see it. We're on the ground now here in Heathrow. Gonna go uh, hit up our connecting flight. We've got like three hours. But Heathrow security is always, always tight. So um, we could have like an hour before we're chilling at our gate. And I'm not business class for this one. Something kind of awkward about travel, especially. It's like, you're in England, all these people on the bus, nobody's saying a word. All right, all right, made it through security. There's a lot of great things that came out of England. I mean, Sean Stafford, lots of great things. Um, the airport security people at Heathrow, though, are not, are not some of them. They are not some of the greatest things. Queen, yes. The people at Heathrow are wankers. Sorry, Heathrow, but you are. Final Your chicken. Ladies and gentlemen, the captain has now switched on his fast seatbelt signs. Customers sitting in the front row seats and emergency exit row should place all items in the air. Leaving the floor area around your seat completely clear. Please now check that your table is folded away, your seat belt is in the sorry, your seat is in the landing position, put your armrest down and your seat belt is securely fastened. Device for landing, 
This must be held securely or placed into a pocket. Just checking out the Wall of Fame here in Sweden. This is the quietest baggage claim I've ever seen. It's kind of haunting. Guys, this has been a pretty seamless trip so far, knock on wood, <laughs> because there hasn't been anyone, there hasn't been any crowds. So when there's not any crowds, you don't have to wait in line, things go fast. So we're gonna get to the hotel. Hopefully it's like the middle of the day in LA. So it's literally 12 o'clock. I say literally, because I can't say literally, literal, literally, literally. I say like the English, I say like the English too. Um, so I'm gonna get a workout in. Um, hopefully hotel's nice and plush with firm, medium to firm pillows. If I don't have medium to firm pillows, I send them back. I feel like I'm in a scene right now of the movie A Girl with a Dragon Tattoo. But the only difference is, so here, I'm saying the trees and everything, it looks like the Pacific North Northwest. Boise, Pacific Northwest. Seattle, which I was from, Pacific Northwest. The only thing is, they don't have anything like they can kill you. No bears, no cougars, no wolverines, no, I don't know, coyotes, no anything. 